What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Glassy here, and uh, I'm about to go see if I can pick up these pan these Pantone these Pantone Sevens without a raffle ticket to see if they sitting or whatever. Cause on the Nike app they is sitting, so I'm gonna see if I can go pick them up at the mall without a uh, raffle ticket. And if so, then I'm gonna come back and do a review and on foot for y'all. So just continue to like, subscribe, thumbs up this video. Cause I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be able. I'm confident, confident enough to know that I'm gonna be able to pick up these Pantone Sevens. So I'm gonna get back with y'all. Let's get it. Troublemaker in the neighborhood for his troublemaking goals, yeah. House party of the road, yeah. I'm not kidding, play this kid, doesn't play about the flow, yeah. Y'all keep playing with your nose, yeah. You get high and do the most, yeah. How you let the kid fighting ghost writing rumors turn into a ghost? Oh, you got Joe. You're a hero, bleed bell. Chino skateboard beat. Hey, bleed bell. Chino skateboard beat. Hey, bleed bell. Chino skateboard beat. Yeah, you know, jamming a little bit on my way to go get these uh sevens. But so this is a real slept on shoe, man. I talked to most of my guys. They ain't trying to cop it, but you know, they cop them what they like. We all cop what we like, so it ain't a big deal. But I don't know, man. I wish I had somebody to go get these with. You know what I'm saying? Your boy's still in the game. Don't get it twisted, man. No matter what I go through, I'm still gonna be in the game. I'm still gonna cop. You feel me? But uh, yeah, this the real slept on shoe, so this shouldn't be no problem to go in here and just cop a pair of something somewhere. I want to go back and finish line because I, I was looking booty as hell the last time. So, I want to go back in there and put a lot of band on them, folk, on them fools, man. They're making me look booty as fuck. So, hopefully, I'm going to go in there and see if I can snag me, snag me a pair. And, uh, but this is a good thing for Jordan Brand far as, you know, everybody being able to just go get a shoe. You ain't got to really worry about busting your ass trying to get a raffle or this and that. You know what I'm saying? You can just go. Snag you a shoe and be cool. You ain't gotta worry about no hassle, no nothing. I mean, it's still kind of like that with certain shoes, but uh, not as bad as it was like last year. Last year it was terrible, terrible. You couldn't cop not one shoe, but uh, it's a good thing I think. But then you got people complaining now, like what's going on with Jordan Brand? Well, y'all was crying, y'all couldn't get a shoe. So let's uh be humble, people, and be appreciative that we can cop what we want now. You know what I'm saying? I think a lot of people are sleeping on these because I'm, co I'm copper uh, foam pies is going to come out. I ain't a big foam head, but never had a pair of foams. I got to snatch me a pair. You know, I got to give me a pair. But, uh, yeah, so we going to um, get in this mall, see what we can do. And uh, I'll get back with y'all. Okay, we here. We at the mall. Uh, we gonna see if we can get in here. And see if we can uh, cut these shoes, man. So let's get in here and see what we can do. Get out here. Get my motherfucking cements all wet, but it's cool. As long as I get the shoes, I'm gonna be in and out. Finish line first, so I'll catch y'all later. As y'all can see, getting the pants on sevens was a success. It's an easy walk in and grab. So, get back to the house and do this review.
<sighs> Alright y'all, let's get back to the house. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Glass City Sneakerhead. And uh, we back from the mall. I end up I end up getting these Pantone 7s. I didn't think I was gonna get them, so this is an unexpected pickup or cop for me because I didn't think I was gonna get them, but I couldn't miss them because it just complements these 11s right here. And this ain't a collab video. I just think it looks nice with both of these right here. I am going to talk about these a little bit. But we already did the review on these already. But I just think I like how... I think Jordan Brand did that on purpose to make this like a little collaboration. Even though it didn't come in a pack. But this could have been a UNC pack. But I'm glad he released them separate. Because we didn't get stuck with no $500 price tag. You know, but uh... Yeah, this was an easy cop. A lot of people were sleeping on these 7s. Uh... I was just a walk in and grab. I didn't have to, you know, raffle tickets and all that because I, I expected that. I already been keeping the profile on these shoes and peeping them before they came out. And by the way, it was looking, it was looking like people wasn't going, you know, was going to sleep on them because I don't know if it's because the copper phone pods is coming out or if they just couldn't get them or what it was. But I walked in and got mine. Easy. Um, one thing I did want to say was, uh, Appreciate all the love and support I've been having. I went from zero subscribers to 40 some subscribers, almost 50. So we're still trying to reach that 100 subscribers mark for slowly climbing, but we getting there together. And I just want to say thank y'all for that. Um, thank y'all for tuning into my videos. Shout out to uh, Ringo Kicks for uh, showing me some support and all that. So he doesn't have to do that. And I don't know if he got them or not. I will stay tuned to see if he picked these up or not. I probably know he didn't sleep on these, but um, yeah. A couple of little flaws in these. Um, well, I'm sorry. Get into the box. Got the nine and a half. And there goes the, you know, the usual stuff you get on a Jordan box. You ain't got to that. But like this, it's kind of like a, this could go for a suede, but it's really not a suede. Um, it's like a door buck. It's kind of like a door buck on there, but it's real nice. It feels like real suede. That's how it feels. Like real suede is real nice and soft. And on the, uh, on the shoe laces right here, I'm taking these out. I'm putting white laces in mine. But I don't like this. I don't like that blue on the laces like that. That blue on blue doesn't make the shoe not stand out as much. But um, on the laces right here, you have a, uh, I think this is dope. You have a little white little jump man on there with a the sweet and these metal on top of that. And then you have a white jump man right here on the upper made out of uh like like a sold in fabric got a pull tag back here just in that unc blue and you got the two three in the back with the white behind it with the white logo behind it and this two three is kind of a lighter blue than the rest of the shoe it's not unc blue it's kind of like a real 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 light sky blue then you got the mid soles which is got the little shark teeth things on there that's all white you know, they ain't put no blue or nothing on there. Then on the bottom, you got the sky blue jump man, and then all white clear bottom. Inside, we got a jump man, then shoe size nine and a half, and then we got the where it's made from and stuff in the inside. Only thing I don't like is on this one, I'm, I might take these ones back and it'll give me another pair in the nine size nine, because this is bent. Like, this is how the shoe's coming, I don't understand it. Then it make it, make it, make you think that they, um, uh, UAs and stuff because the way they look you know what I'm saying like man I kind of don't I'm kind of starting to see now when I see certain UAs they do look better than uh the, the uh, retail pair you know it's a couple of glue stains on here but overall I'm not gonna complain it still came out pretty good shoes still came out pretty darn good now one thing about me is I know I like to wear my kicks um kind of loose I think they look better like that I don't like to tie them up I don't like having my shoes all tied up tight you know it's not it don't support your foot good enough but overall this is a nice shoe when you know this shoe was first released or came about and the, and the appearance was in like 2010 or 11 or something it was a sample shoe at the time it wasn't even a, um, a official shoe it was a sample shoe which costs more people can't get samples and certain people can get them people like us can't get them unless i get big one day i don't even know certain youtubers don't even get samples like that but so i guess jordan brand decided to release it to the general public i don't know if it's because of the unc winning the championship or he just wanted to do it but he ended up 
giving us the shoe, and I'm real, real appreciative of that. You know, um, if you is sleeping, y'all better go cop them before they do sell out. You know, uh, I would cop these. These is dope, real dope shoe. Uh, you know, you know they're gonna drop a period to go with them, but uh, dope, real classic, you know, real smooth and soft, man. This is gonna stand out. Hey. You know the girls gonna be all on you if you pull these kicks out. You know what I mean? This is something that this is the type of color girl is attracted to. This, this. You know what I'm saying? So I got both of them. I had it. I had to get both. I, I got both. You know I mean? I'm gonna be putting these on ice too. I don't be wearing them either. But uh, overall, dope shoe, nice colorway, nice decent price tag. This need to get the color, the quality control a little better. Then I'll be a little more happy. But other than that, dope shoe. So done with talking about the shoe. We went over all the details. Let's take it straight to the feet. I'll catch y'all and see y'all in a minute. Well, that's it for that video, YouTube. Um, all my people that support me continue to watch me. Uh, like and subscribe to my channel. Let's continue to grow. Let's continue this positivity and this passion for sneakers. And let's show the youth that it's more to life than just violence and negativity and stuff like that. We can do it through other stuff that we like. Because that's something we can catch their attention now. It's through stuff we like in a positive way. So for that, like I said, subscribe. Thumbs up the video. Comment down below. I want to know if it was easy for anybody else to cop these shoes like it was for me. And that's it. I'll catch y'all with another video. Bye.